I think the, the way I've described Pinehurst on Sunday was like it was a great day until it wasn't. I did things on that Sunday that I haven't been able to do in the last couple of years. Took control of the golf tournament, um, held held putts when I needed to. Well, mostly when I needed to. I can you know vividly remember starting to feel a little uncomfortable waiting for my my second putt on 16, and um, you know the putt on the putt on the last was a you know it was a really tricky putt, and I was very aware of where Bryson was off the tee, so. I knew I had to hit it really soft. If 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 the one back didn't matter, I would have hit it firmer and it would have been. But because I was sort of in two minds, I didn't know whether Bryson was going to make a par or not. It was one of those ones where I just had to, I had to make sure that if the putt didn't go in, that it wasn't going 10 feet by, which it very easily could have. So, you know, I, I look back on that day, just like I look back in some of my toughest moments in my career. And, and um, you know, I, I'll, I'll learn a lot from it. Um, and and I'll hopefully put that to good use. And I've you know it's something that's been a you know a bit of a theme throughout my career. I've been able to take those tough moments and um, and turn them into uh, into great things. Not not very long after that.